Hello YouTubers, it's Neil Neil's Coins again. Uh, quick video, I say it's quick. Probably gonna be a little longer than I want it to go, but the reason I'm making this video, I am fixing to send some coins off to be graded. <clears throat> I wanna kinda do a before and after video. You have, if you've watched my videos, you have seen these coins before, probably. Uh, but, like I said, I'm just going to go over real quickly uh, what I got. And we'll see in the next video. It'll be a little while. It takes usually about six weeks to get them back. Uh, we'll see what the grades are. Some stuff's going to go to PCGS and some's going to go back to NGC uh, to be re-holdered. And I'll go after... Uh, talk about those after I go through these. All right, most of these are Morgan dollars. Uh, there is one quarter. If I can find it. What I did with it. There it is. All right, I'm going to do the quarter first. Uh, this is a 32D Washington quarter. Some of them scratches. You see them scratches on the film. Uh, real nice shape. 32D is the key date. Uh, it looks uncirculated, but we'll see. And it looks real. They fake these. So I really want to get this one certified that it's real. It's probably been cleaned. Got a couple spots there. I'm just trying to. Try my luck with this one. I don't know if it's going. If it comes back clean. It may come back clean uncirculated. It may come back clean circulated. Or AU. Um. I'm really hoping for the uh, cleaned, uncirculated for this one. That's probably what it's going to be. We'll see in the next video when it comes back. All right, the rest of them are mostly Morgan dollars. Uh, this one, a real beautiful 1882S. Proof lock on one side, you can see in the fields. Uh, that it's proof like on the front, but the reverse is just a normal, real nice, normal coin. Got some toning going on. Uh, real nice coin. I think it'll go 64. It does have a dent on her cheek or her chin there. Uh, I think it'll go 64. May go 65. I doubt it. We'll see on that one in the next video. Uh, next one up is a 1880S 0 over 9, and it's proof light also. It's also the VAM 12, which makes it uh, the O over 9. You can see the back is proof lock also. Uh, I think it's a 63 PL. That's what I got on it. Um, it may or may not come back that grade. We'll see. I'm going to have this one VAM. That VAM makes it work more since it's an O over 9. And the variety like I got 200 on it I think that's what it retails for uh, at 63 PL real nice coin next one up uh, yeah, yeah I did a video on this one for sure this is an 87 uh, alligator eye the variety VAM 12A the eyes doubled uh, Real nice coin. I think it's a 63 all day long. 
It does have a scratch on her cheek. That might hurt it, but the overall appearance, the fields are real clean. I think it's a strong 63. Uh, I don't know if it'll get a 64 grade or not. Let's see. We'll know when it comes back. Next up is another alligator eye. This one has toning on it. Uh, same van. I'm going to have these uh, varieties uh, notified on the, on the slab. So I will have to pay more for that. Uh, it's a 63 all day long. I don't know. Though. The cheek's real clean. It may go 64. I got it listed as a 63. We'll see on that one. Next up. Uh, this one I ain't really worried about the grade so much. This one I just want to get encapsulated. I think it's a 62, maybe a 63. But the reason I want to send this one off, it's real pretty on the front. But it's prettier on the back. I want this one. I just really want to get this one encapsulated uh, real pretty rainbow toning on that one we'll see what it comes back uh, next up now this is a 1899O Morgan um, I think this is a 65 this thing here the fields are real nice. It's got a little chatter on her cheek. Just a little bit out there in front of her nose. But the rest of it's perfect. No chatter whatsoever. There is a dye crack right there, which is kind of common. It's not flat. Uh, I think this one goes 65. I got it listed as a 65. In a 65, it's worth probably 140 bucks. Real pretty coin. But we'll see. Uh, next up, okay. This one is an 85 Morgan Dollar. It's also proof lock. If I can get it to work, there it goes. You can tell it's proof lock. And it's proof lock on both sides. Real nice coin. It's a 64 all day long. Uh, a little bit too much chatter going on the front to be a 65 if you look at the back back's perfect i don't see well there's a little something going on above the eagles head there it's worth about a retail 140 bucks we'll see what it grades out uh, yeah next up is an 84 common coin um but then again, this one's in nice shape. Uncirculated. I got it graded as a 64. This one may go 64. Oh, I know it'll be a 64. Knock on wood. But um, I'm hoping for a 65. In a 65, uh, it's about a hundred and something dollar coin. Not a real rare coin. All right, here's another toned coin you've seen in one of my videos there again it's not a valuable coin but it's toned real pretty i must want to get this one encapsulated too i still think it's a go of 63 uh it's really about a 75 dollar coin i got a hundred on it because of the toning i've had this coin quite a while yeah it's 63 or yeah it's a van 14, but that van don't, don't make it worth worth much more than what it is. It's not a real rare van. Now this one is a 88, eight, excuse me, 1888. This one is uh, a sought after van. Uh, it's in the top 50 or the hot 50. Real nice coin. This will be another one that I'll have verified in the van. Now this one here. There's something going on with her cheek. And if you know anything about coins and luster, it's got two dents on her cheek there. 
you see it right there but the luster is over the top of them so that happened in the die as it was pressed or minted whatever uh, you can see the luster jumping off that I don't know what that is going to be but also at the same time she's got a real pretty cheek not a lot of stuff going on in the fields the back of the bird real nice uh, curious to see what this is Ooh, if I don't drop it uh, what this one grades out also all right let's see what's next oh okay this is just a really a harder date to get it's a 1880 1891 s uh in a 63 these things are about 175 dollars now one grade higher in a 64 they're 400 and something dollars but I don't think this one will go 64. Uh, it might. I'm kind of hoping it will. Of course, everybody hopes to make more money. But this one's a nice 63 example. Uh, it's a harder... Harder, not the hardest, but it's a hard San Francisco coin to find in good shape. Uh, what's next? Okay, I got another tone. This one is a piece dollar that I did make a video on. It's got pretty toning. I just want to get this one encapsulated. I'm not worried about the price or the value uh so much it's it's a 23 and a 23 and it's 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 probably a 75 dollar coin i don't know it may go more i won't know until i get it back as far as the grade value but that pretty tone in there make it worth a little bit more i think it's a in 64, I'm not sure I ain't got my book out, but I think it's like a $90 coin, somewhere around there, $85, $90. And I believe I got it marked up due to the toning. I shouldn't have any problem getting rid of that one. What else I got in here? I got a 28S piece dollar. Real nice coin. I'm not sure if I did a video on this one or not. 28 S's are hard to uh, come by in a high grade. It's probably a uh, 63, 62, 63, 62, 63, right on that one. Not a very, well in a 64 it's, it, pretty good price on it and last but not least i think last as far as the raw coins are considered 34 kind of a hard date real nice coin real nice luster and a high grade it's uh 63 or better it's like i want to say it's up in the two three hundred dollar range i don't think this one it might go 63 i'm hoping for it but we'll find out all right that's all my raw ungraded uh coins now next up is i'm gonna have recapsulated uh, this is 80, 1880S. It's graded MS65PL. Proof light. 
it's definitely proof light. I don't like this case. I'm gonna have it recut. Just and I can't remember really what they charge. It's it's not much to have them re uh, encapsulated. This one will be going to uh, NGC, and all these will be going to uh, PCDS. And one more. It's kind of a double. I showed this uh, in another video. Thought it was neat. They don't make this case anymore, so I'm going to try to see if I can get them encapsulate them separately and give me you know they what here's the grade they, they graded a proof 67 uh, uh i'm not sure if they'll do that i don't see why not if i have to pay for it you know i'll pay the difference it shouldn't be that much but this thing you can see it's all scratched up it's kind of big and bulky And all of those scratches you see is actually on the plastic. You kind of have to look through that. Uh, I'm going to send them off. Being right here at Christmas, uh, it'll probably take a little longer. I don't know. Everybody, they may... Uh, People may be spending their money on Christmas and not getting coins graded, so it might free up some time. I'm not sure if the uh, grading companies slack off for Christmas or not, or how many days they close up, but we'll find out. Stay tuned for the next video, the second video of this one. And uh, I'm really hoping this quarter comes back uncleaned. It looks too shiny. Um, We'll see. I hope it's real. If it's real, it's if it's real, it's a minimum of uh, about five hundred bucks for a quarter. But uh, anyway, stay tuned for my next video. Please like, subscribe, and uh, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Whatever you got to do. Um, oh yes, before I go, I was just elected. Uh, I'm in a local coin club here in georgia and yeah, the west georgia coin club and i was just re uh, elected president this year so congrats to me uh if anybody is in the georgia area atlanta area wants to join the club it's 12 dollars uh membership we meet every monday night in Carrollton, uh, and we have a uh, website you can go to and get all the details. Uh, they haven't changed the uh, president name over yet. Uh, they won't do that till the first of the year. So if you don't see my name up there, Neil, uh, they just haven't changed it yet. But uh, anyway, thanks and uh, like my videos.